matchup, which we've seen a lot of. Sinji versus Frozen, Pac-Man versus Palutena. This is a patient man's match. Yeah, you know, you know about this matchup a bit? Like, I uh, have seen a couple of matches. <laughs> a few. It's, um... I, have, I haven't really watched too much of this matchup. Um, you know, he does have the, <laughs> the reflect I was about to say, and there it is. It's, it's pretty uh, good. He, <laughs> he, he kind of, like, stops uh, Pac-Man from playing as campy. Mm -hmm. It's, um... I think the thing is, right, is that a lot of Sinji's setups aren't necessarily like, I'm gonna get you with a projectile, they just want to instill the fear of it, and then he'll go for, oh, I'll go for grabs, or I'll come up for this, I'm trying to bait an option out of you, etc. And this is what'll happen, is that Sinji will get some kind of conversion, he'll hit you for like 67 braces percent, and you'll have to climb the hill all over again. And because... Uh, yeah. And then you have to come to him. And then because Palutena just doesn't have, like, a crazy get-in game, uh, it becomes a really, really patient affair of like, oh, I've got to get a little bit of damage against Sinji here. I've got to do a little bit here. I can't freak out when he hits me with this setup, that setup. Because if you just get caught, you're dead. Did you see his spacing there? He was like, all right, this hydrant is going to go right above me. And I'm going to throw the key right here. <laughs> He's not even a key. Very aware of his hydrant. Absolutely. And many of his setups not uh, particularly committal either. It's very difficult to actively catch Cindy during a setup unless you know what it is and even then your options aren't particularly strong you just have to sort of take it as it comes and hope he doesn't get too strong of a setup next time stuff like that I'm so that glad is, he punished that crap that yes a very quick room to drop off that platform with there that is probably um, because grab is better it's still not amazing um, that's one of the strongest places you can get punishes in this matchup is when Cindy tries to go for a grab because he has to he has to to enforce the Wow, I thought just taking the, I just gave him the boot. Yeah, I guess, you know, the bell would have, like, went up anyways, right? Since you reflected, I, I guess it, like, you know, yeah. wasn't the best idea. No worries. And very Understandable, though. You know, you, you, you want to counter these projectiles. Well, counter is only... I feel uh, like counter is only see the <laughs> Sorry. I want to see the teleport <laughs> trump bear or something like that. Oh, yeah. Something real fancy. And then that's... Surprised that that hydrant didn't hit him. Speaking of Trump, that was a real good uh, threat in there. Nice. Go out, good counter. Yeah, it runs off with that counter. Nice. That was clean. That was. That was an exceptional conversion. Yeah, he, off he did advantage. not want to uh, trample in there. Yeah, absolutely. Not. I mean, I don't blame him because that makes his uh, recovery a lot more predictable, right, I would up, argue. Setting up the Narricade. Keeping him away from Hydra, which is a good call. All right. Yeah, I really wanted to see how much he was using, like, going to use auto radical in this matchup. Mm -hmm. um, not as much as like, like I thought, I guess. It's it's tricky, right? Because the it, hydrant is. Almost... I can see him breaking hydrant last second with it. Yes. You know what I mean? Like, after Sinji hits it. But I could also see it like, um, I don't know, making hydrant weaker if he hits it too early, making it, it easier for Sinji to just like, you know, hit it with a weak move. It could. I think one of the main things about hydrant is that um, it's primarily used as a safety, so that Sinji can set up, get his projectiles, do what he wants there, and if he baits you into hitting it, like, oh, let me get this. Nice. That's, that's what you were talking about. Yeah, that that's was what I was clean. talking about. Yeah, yeah. I'm glad we got to see that. Um, Yo. That is sick. It. That is sick. That's honestly. That's I, what's I definitely got hit by that uh, over the weekend, and I was definitely like not upset. I you was were like, <laughs> I was like, okay, all right, I really deserve that. It's you like, set that up? yo, okay. yo, like, there's no possible way to do that accidentally. And again, like, that has to be manually spaced. You can't just like be a neutral and go, oh, I've got a, I've got a shortcut to do the sledge cancel. You just have to know. Yeah, I where mean, it is. it's it's literally like pretty much right there is yes. where he could ledge cancel off. Mm -hmm. And then if you misspace it, uh, you die. You yeah, it, it's upstairs. you know it's not that bad. It's actually not too bad. <laughs> All right, very good. But those um, capitalizing so hard when Sinji's off stage is honestly what is keeping him in the game right now. Yeah, it's like kill. Sometimes you just gotta hit him with the simple stuff, you know. Run up, let me throw the spell. <laughs> There's nothing crazy here. Hydrants. Yeah. But yes, Hydrant very much like a safety. Uh, it's like, oh, if I can bait you to hitting it, then you're in. I always forget if it's hit Definitely lag. Definitely a miss input into <laughs> a miss input. That's F smash cool. into backwards grab. It's a shame because that was uh, probably one of the cleanest punish scenarios he was going to be able to get. This set. Especially now that Sinji knows, or I would hope he knows, to watch out more for that teleport cancel. Yeah, it's like, I mean, you can watch out for it, but it's like, there's only so much you can do when she has so many, like, options. Mm -hmm. Can we talk also about how this is, um, 
once more in Sinji's favor from him being stocked down previously. Or I believe I, it happens so fast. Like, he just comes back with these setups. See, stuff like that. One of the best choices there was to hold shield. And once you get out of it, Pac-Man has Bell again. And you're in an ugly spot. That was good. All right. I'm trying to get him on the edge guard. He doesn't have too many opportunities. Yeah, yeah, he definitely uh, tried to read him going back there and, and charging up. But uh, smart from Sinji actually just, like, moving inwards. Very good. Uh, oh, the backbreaker. Yeah, that was... That was quite the late feeling. <laughs> yeah, and the um again, I don't know if it's hit stun, hit lag, whatever the correct term is, but that keeps that there in place for a long time. It keeps the key hitbox active. It's it's scary. It's very scary to be anywhere on stage when Pac-Man has Bell, Pac-Man has key, and this sort of thing. Um, it's so weird to think that he... It's not weird to think that he brought that back, but rather he was incredibly patient with that back. And going over to Peach, I actually don't know too much about this character in general, let alone the matchup. She's really good. She is very good. I can tell you a lot of people think she might be best, but uh, uh, top five. Uh, I sure. would definitely say top five is easy. She's very technical, but I think she has some of the best combos in the game. Her recovery is not so bad that it... Uh, ruins her as a character, like with, say, like, Krom or someone like that. Her on-stage presence is good. She has a projectile, which is really great to have. Uh, and he's dead. Not what you want to see. Peach, unfortunately, uh, Definitely what Parasol Sinji does not go that far. would like to see. Yeah. <laughs> so this is, I want to be perfectly honest, this is one of those scenarios that I feel is very mentally taxing to come by. Because you know that now that Sinji has this sizable of a lead, He's going to take extra yeah. care to play passive. It's just like, up. that's Definitely that almost killed. killed. And like a player like Frozen, uh, he has good composure. Like, he's just going to keep playing. Like, yeah, that, that stock's gone, but like, yes. still got to try your hardest. Absolutely. And that's uh, one of the defining factors, I feel, in top level players is mental composure under stress. And it's not to say that, you know, like top players don't get salty or get emotive. But, oh, like, definitely not. They're just really good at, like, um, you know, Keeping it cool when they're playing. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Did it, you see... it comes with like time too. A lot of like he's he's been playing a very long time. Did hold, you see that guys. setup with turn up by the way? I don't know if that was active the whole time, but that looked like it would actually catch two frames like very reliably. I'm not sure. Uh, what, on the ledge? Yeah, he tossed turn up into the back of the ledge and it was sort of just spinning there. I don't yeah. know if it was active the whole time, but if it was, that's a really interesting call. I've never seen that. Alright. Interesting interaction with the fire hydrant. He's behind. He reverses the key, doesn't get anything off of it. Right. Pac-Man playing is very safe. Ooh, the booty. This might be a potent kill move now. Absolutely. It's actually, uh, it beats out a lot of moves. It's, I don't know if it's straight disjointed, uh, or if it has trample or what. But Never actually looked at the hitbox. It's, it's quite generous. I like it. It's a good move, you know, it's... <laughs> It looks good. I'm glad it is, honestly. It's it's nothing crazy either. I don't think there's any particularly crazy move in this game, save maybe like two or three. But I think it's a very nice tool. It's a good one that she has. Uh, keeping himself delayed on the hydrant there was really interesting. I've noticed that he can choose whether or not to pass through the hydrant with pellet, which is an interesting thing to know. Getting that out. And Peach is capable of putting out Ooh. so many hitboxes. <laughs> Very nice. Oh, oh she's dead. Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah, steals that champion. Um, you know, still still not too bad. You know, he was working with a way worse deficit before. Um, so he's actually come back a little bit. Even though it's a, a stock down, he's, you know, he's got the ledge trap right now. He's not in the worst spot. Not at all. Although you gotta you gotta be happy, especially when you like SD, like you're like, all right, you know, I'm I'm coming back. This isn't bad. Like, not at all. Absolutely. In fact, he could get. <laughs> I just always think they're gonna like up B, but like, why? <laughs> Something crazy. Yeah. Uh, oh, I thought he was yeah, gonna angle that up to try to uh, cover with the fire hydrant, but nope. Sinji keeping away, slowly racking up this percent and doing what he does best of testing patience. You know. He's willing to take oh. even just a couple of percent with his setups. And he's got a lead right now, so why not? 
So the cherry, see, even stuff like that. One, two percent, a decimal per. Ooh, Fire Hydrant extending the hitbox. Let's go. That's what I like to see. All right. Keeping away. So this is. This I've, is the equivalent of being down a stock. Yes. Um, In a way, it's just like. I feel like he's got a. Has the combo game to really rack the percent up? Same with Pac-Man. Pac-Man, if you look away for like ten seconds, you can be you like, you can put Yo. him to sixty right now. Like, yeah, it's like, but it, you know, Peach can definitely die to a lot. Apple will kill him. Key will kill. Playing very tricky with the Hydrant. He's not coming for a direct engagement, and he does not need to. Yeah, really, no need. You know, just keep forcing the That's issue. That's yep. rough. That was a good setup, though. Yeah, good stuff. Really, like, took all that airspace right there. Mm -hmm. And let's see what happens. Exactly. Yeah, I'm trying to see if he could have. Oh, he air dodged no, right he into it. He he kind of got like uh air yeah he was air dodging to avoid the key and then gets hit by the hydrant. So yeah, that was ultra intelligent. I'm not gonna lie.